except for my father, two men have helped to shape who I am. One of them was Bill Feige. Here's a scientist who helped to wipe out smallpox in India. He went on from there and uh, ran the Centers for Disease Control, and then he began to uh, be a, a, a critical advisor to Bill and Melinda Gates as they got their foundation up and running. What a remarkable life. What you do right now in a cause and effect world is going to have implications for a person born 300 years from now, and we better be thinking about that. That there's something better than science, and that is science with a moral compass. Scientists increasingly have to be national leaders as well. Uh, Harold Varmus is a man who won a Nobel Prize. A lot of his research rotated around cancer, and he's really become a leader on the national stage. Scientists need to think of themselves as citizens and as activists, and I spend a lot of time trying to advocate for science by either working with Congress, working with administration, to explain to the public and to people who make decisions and have money why, is, why it's so important to promote the growth of science. Science, while it can be used for good or for evil, is one of the few ways we have to understand the world and make the world better.